Rebecca, who slammed doors for fun and perished miserably by Hilaire Belloc, 1870 to 1953. A trick that everyone abhors in little girls is slamming doors. A wealthy banker's little daughter, who lived in Palace Green Bay's water, by name Rebecca Offendort, was given to this furious sport. She would deliberately go and slam the door like billy to make her Uncle Jacob start she was not really bad at heart, but only rather rude and wild. She was an aggravating child. It happened that a marble bust of Abraham was standing just above the door this little lamb had carefully prepared to slam. And down it came, it knocked her flat, it laid her out, she looked like that. Her funeral sermon, which was long, and followed by a sacred song, mentioned her virtues, it is true, but dwelt upon her vices too, and showed the dreadful end of one who goes and slams the door for fun. The children who were brought to hear the awful tale from far and near were much impressed and inly swore they never more would slam the door as often they had done before. Okay, this poem is by Hilaire Belloc. Let's see, Hilaire Belloc was born in France. He was born in uh, uh, La Celle saint cloud in Yveline near Paris. Um, and then he uh, moved to uh, England um, and let's see, he went to Balliol College, Oxford. He became the, um, the, he the president of the Oxford Union, the Oxford Debating Society. Um, also notice he was a Catholic, which in the UK is fairly rare. Um, <clears throat> And he was also a politician. He was a member of parliament, I think, for the Conservative Party. Um, OK, so let's see. Um, OK, he, he is most famous for writing a book of cautionary tales for children, of which this one is one. Um, this is in, in the vein of Lewis Carroll or um, Edward Lear, who wrote things that were supposedly for children, but with more appeal for um, adults. Um, also, uh, in the same vein, perhaps Roald Dahl as well. Roald Dahl was one of, uh, uh, was somebody who followed him close, closely. Um, let's see, Belloc was a friend of G.K. Chesterton and of George Bernard Shaw. So, what's this about? Well, this is about Rebecca, who's a girl, who slammed doors because she enjoyed slamming doors and it caused her death. Uh, th this, let's see, what what is behind this? No, I think this is just um, something that's uh, fun and I suppose amusing for adults. A trick that everyone abhors, hates, in little girls is slamming doors. So slam the door, you shut it with a loud bang. A wealthy banker's little daughter who lived in Palace Green, Bay's Water. So she lived in a good area of London. By name, Rebecca Offendort was given to this furious sport. To me, this is uh, very reminiscent of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. She would deliberately go and slam the door like Bilio. Okay, like bilio, this is a rather old-fashioned phrase saying you do something very hard and a lot. To make her uncle Jacob start, to make him jump. <gasps> she was not really bad at heart, so she wasn't a bad child. Only rather rude and wild. So rude and wild. She was an aggravating child. She annoyed people. It happened that a marble 
bust. A bust is a statue of the head and shoulders of somebody. Of Abraham was standing just above the door this little lamb had carefully prepared to slam. Okay, so a, there's a bust of Abraham from the Bible. And this is above the door that the little lamb, the sweet little girl, this is ironic, had carefully prepared to slam. So she carefully, she was going to slam this door. And down it came. So she slammed it and down came the bust. It knocked her flat. It laid her out. She looked like that. So it knocked her out. It laid her on the ground and uh, it killed her. Her funeral sermon, which was long and followed by a sacred song, so the sermon at her funeral was there was a long sermon and it was followed by a, a, a hymn mentioned her virtues it is true so in her sermon they talked about her in her funeral they talked about the good things her virtues but dwelt upon her vices too so to dwell upon to focus on to spend some time discussing and showed the dreadful end to one who goes and slams the door for fun. So, yeah, it all, it concentrated on the fact that a dreadful end is in store for anybody who slams doors for fun. The children who were brought to hear the awful tale from far and near were much impressed. So, children who had been brought to the funeral from all sorts of places um, in order to hear the what had happened uh, to Re Rebecca who slammed doors and they were very impressed by this and they inly swore so internally they promised yeah inly inside the adverb of in they in internally promised they swore they would they never more would slam the door. So they'd stop slamming doors, as they had often done before. So there you go. Um, if you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you soon. Bye for now. Rebecca, who slammed doors for fun and perished miserably, by Hilaire Belloc.